Welcome back. Welcome back. What's going on, subbies? And hello to all my newbies. And just in case you don't even know what a newbie is, I'm about to tell you exactly what it is. A newbie be anybody, maybe, perhaps, checking me out for the first time, for the second time, maybe for the third or the fourth we do not keep tabs around here on our looky-loos because it doesn't even really matter. It really doesn't. I just want all of my subbies and I want all of my newbies to come on in, come on in, come on in. Okay, so for today, I think you guys read the title before you tiptoed in here. And just in case you didn't notice the shirt, Today, yes, we are going to do a hair update, a, well, a relaxer update and hair check-in. It's the first one of the year. And yeah, just like last year, we're just going to keep everything going so that we can keep everybody abreast of what is happening in each other's hair lives. You see what I'm saying? Because <laughs> that's what we do around here. We like to check in every well now it's about every eight weeks because that's around the time that i relax my hair yes ma'am i relax my hair every about every seven to eight weeks give or take and when i relax you guys know that i like to trim my hair trimming is very important to not only maintaining the health of your hair but also in establishing its growth now, for all those who are coming in for the very first time, and it may seem counterproductive to cut your hair and also have it grow long, trimming helps to keep split ends at bay. Split ends, as you know, can cause breakage. So we like to stay ahead of any type of mishaps or any type of hair maladies that may come upon us. And we like to keep a trimming schedule to stay ahead of all of that as well as it helps to keep your hair looking uniformed. So now that we've gotten that out of the way, we're going to jump right into it, okay? I'm going to show you what I'm working with, and I'm going to update you on any products or anything that has changed or stay, stayed the same, pretty much, because y'all know that I have my steady betties, holy grails, day ones, you get the picture. The products that I love and that are staples in my regimen, We'll just go over relaxer day, talk about that. Then I'm going to show y'all, you know, what I'm working with. And then we're just going to get up out of here. See, easy peasy. So as far as hair products are concerned, no new hair products. And no no ma'am, no ma'am, no new hair products, except for the fact that, and those who are initiated and familiar with, I think my last two videos or my last hair update, I use Precise Relaxer. I was not able to find it in mild, so I bought it in the Supreme, the Super. Not that I was going to use the Super, but what I told you guys was that I was going to basically fraction off the activator to equal what it would be in the mild version. And I just wanted to show you guys really quickly what I was talking about. So this is the precise relaxer that I used. And this is in the Supreme or the Super, okay? So this is its strongest, strongest version. So what I did was I kept the bottle from the mild relaxer that I had. I kept the last bottle, empty bottle. So this is how much activator comes in the mild versus the Super or the Supreme where the fill line or the activator goes up to this line, okay? So they give you more activator than in the mild. So this is the super and this is the mild. So they give you less activator in the mild than the super. And there lies the difference. It's all in the activator. So with that being said, I did my little pouring in and I filled it up to this particular fill line and then I mixed it all up and then I proceeded to apply it to my head. And everything after that was pretty much, pretty much status quo, pretty, pretty normal. Relaxer day went well 
and my hair came out pretty good. I just relaxed it. So it's been about a week. So I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna wash it tomorrow because I wash my hair every week. That's my regimen, weekly washing. So yeah, that's pretty much the gist as far as the products and anything new and anything old. I basically downgraded the relaxer that I ended up buying, which was the Supreme. That was the last one that they had in the stove. So I did that. And in the meantime, I did order another relaxer from Amazon, the mild version. So now that we've gone over that portion, okay, that was just the hors d'oeuvres. That's just a little palate teaser. Now we're going to get to the main part, the meat and potatoes. And I'm just going to very quickly just show you my hair all around, do a 360 and show you what I'm working with. Then we're just going to come right back and we just, we're going to wrap this up in a bow. So... Let's go. Okay guys, so that was just a little quickie, just to really show you where I am with everything. You know how I do, I like to show you the sides and I like to show you that middle. Again, for me, that was the part that I was really paying attention to because sometimes it would get away from me, meaning that it would thin out. So trimming has really helped me a lot with keeping everything thick all the way through and we we're still doing well i'm still staying on my regimen as far as doing a dusting which is a light trim a very slight trim uh every four weeks and then that eighth week when i relax doing an actual trim and this time i think i trimmed off i want to say close to an inch I, that, that's what I want to say. I don't measure, you know, I was just eyeballing it. So you may not see too much of a difference as far as the length is concerned from my last check-in, but we're still doing well. We're, we're past bra strap length. And like I said, my goal is not to get to waist length, but if I get there by default, I, I'm, I'm not going to be crying in my soup. That, that, that's all I'm going to say, <laughs> you know? And of course, if I get there, I will come back in here and we're just going to celebrate just another milestone that we didn't necessarily prepare for, but it, it's, it's all good. It's all good in the hair hood up in this piece. This relaxer day was good. It really was. I got my proportions right with the activator, so I ain't got no mishaps as far as that's concerned. So it's all good. So I feel good. Did I say good enough times? All right, good. Because the operative word here is good so now that we've established that y'all already know that it's about that time it, yes it is it is about that time we are now at the portion of we are now at the portion of the program where where i i button my lip it, it's enough about me i done jibber jabbered about my hair long enough now it's time to pass the mic it's time to pass the mic to all of y'all and anybody and everybody who wants to give an update on their hair. 
please do. And do tell down below. Maybe you're trying something new for the new year. Maybe you have a new year's resolution as far as your hair is concerned. Maybe you have already audited and edited all of your products as far as the ingredients. And now you're adding all the new ones that are better for your hair. Just let us all know down below. We'd be happy to find out what is going on in your hair life. Not, not, not your personal life, your, your hair life. Okay, Let, let's just keep it. Let's just keep it about hair. Now we do have an official title for this this portion of the video, and it is raw. Yeah! Yes, yes, yes. That is the official title of this portion of the. It's, it's, called, it's called roll call, roll call time. That's what time it is. So, like I said, anybody who wants to jibber jab about themselves. Please do. We are all ears up in this piece. This is the first roll call of 2023. So let's make it count. So while we are waiting for those who want to partake, come up to the front of the congregation, we are about to give the benediction. Yes, we are. I think we've done jibber jabber long enough and we have updated and shown and told what was going on with my my, my do. So now we are going to skip on out of here. I told you this was a quickie. So that wasn't too bad, right? We were in and out, okay? I want to thank you so much for dialing in and showing up. I really do appreciate it. I really do. I really do. And yeah, we'll be back talking about some more stuff. Honey, you better get up back on in here because we got some more stuff to talk about. So you gotta come back for that. So you already know. It's going to be the same Dolce Dial. It's gonna be the same Dolce Channel. So if you come on back. All right.